So basically, I already had my um, boneless chicken done from yesterday. I like my chicken to be very, very soft. I'm sorry. I can't have no chewy ass chicken or no chewy shrimps. So I make sure my food is like soft but cooked all the way. The seasoning that you see on here is, um, see, ground turmeric. No salt. Sasson. I love this. Yes, I love it. And basil leaves. Okay? Nothing major. You know, that's what makes it look so, 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 so good. You know, and you can add, um, I think I'm going to add a little bit of um, fresh um, garlic. And that's why I look so orangey. People thinking it's a bunch of seasoning. No. A bunch of salt. No. That's the enemy. You don't want to put a bunch of salt on your food. Okay? If you have to use a little salt, which I don't like to use salt really too much at all. I never really use it. But if I got the taste and I want some, I use sea salt. And I won't have this forever because I don't fuck with salt like that. Period. Alright? Just waiting on my noodles to finish. Wheat noodles. Here's my Alfredo sauce that I'm going to use. Okay? You don't want to kill it. Okay? You don't want to kill it. Um, this this right here is going to be like three plates, okay? Three. All right? You're not going to sit there and eat all of that, okay? Everything is moderation. You have to remember that. That's so important. I don't care how good it is, how good it looks. Listen, you eat every two to three hours. You can wait every two to three hours to eat again. And make sure every portion is small. So I'm going to use this one. See? See how much I put in there? Just to glaze it, just to give me the little 52 fake out. You don't swallow it or nothing like that. I just turned up the fire a little bit so that it can cook a little bit faster because I'm hungry. Okay. Just move it around. Some, let it get, you know, some of the Alfredo sauce on it. Do not drown it. Your food should not be swallowed inside of it. Remember, everything is in moderation, baby. Girl, girl, oh baby, look at you, look at God, look at God, honey, look at God. <laughs> I love eating, and I love trying to find things to eat. You gotta remember, our journey, our food list is so small. Our food list is so small, so you gotta be creative. You know, and you gotta open your mind too to realize you're gonna have the same things over and over. Okay. You know, because we can't have too many things. But you just got to make it, you know, spicy. Do it different ways. Right? Girl. Girl. Look at God. See, they not ready. They don't hear me, though. They don't hear me, though. Mm, 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 mm. They don't hear me, though. Ooh. You see? I have a saucer. It's not even a big plate. Okay? They don't hear me though. They don't hear me go. <laughs> I said they don't hear me go. I mean, they don't hear me though. Listen, chicken Alfredo. You know you can't have a bunch of sauce, right? So I wouldn't take my sauce and just pour right on top of here. That'd be a no-no. It'd be a do-over. My clients know. I will let you know that round does not count. It doesn't count. Okay, and your food gotta be soft, baby. Mm -mm. I'm not gonna just, you know, settle knowing that I can't really eat everything. I'm not gonna settle just to eat anything. It gotta be scrumptious, honey. You gotta make it scrumptious. You gotta make it scrumptious. And if you want, you can take some of the sauce that's in the pot and put it in here. Don't put no more from the bottle. I'm watching y'all. So I'm gonna take some of that sauce. This is how much I got in here. Well, I did say I was gonna have three, but I'm like, I'm gonna have two. <laughs> so I'm gonna take some of this little sauce, if I could, and put it in here. All right? This is it. 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 That is it. Mm. There you go. Listen, if you play around with your foods, what you're gonna be doing is you're gonna do you're gonna do your way in, and you're gonna be up. Then you're going to be down. Then you're going to be up. Then you're going to be down. Then you're going to be happy. Then you're going to be sad. Listen, who the fuck want to go through that? 
Who wants to go through that? Especially it's about to be summer. These coats about to be off. And, you know, I'm not saying that you're going to be ashamed of your body or you're going to hate your body, but you... Evidently, you're working out for a reason. If you're working out for a reason, that means you're looking for the results. You're looking for a certain area maybe in your body to look better. Or, you know, you want to make sure that this shit go fast as possible. Who want to be doing this forever? Like, busting. Don't get me wrong. This is a lifestyle change. This is not for a moment. But if you get the results that you want, believe me when I tell you, you're going to want to go further. And once you learn that food is what it is, I promise you, I promise you, you're going to want to change your foods. You know what I mean? Whatever your addiction is, whatever, give it to God. Ask God to, listen, let's pray together. How about that? Dear Heavenly Jehovah, your Christ Jesus name, I ask you to lay your hands on each and every one of us that is having a problem with anything that's Anything that is deterring us from our journey. I ask you right now to lay your hands, Lord, on everybody that is going through this journey and trying to put their best foot forward. Give them the power. Give them the strength. Give them the willpower to want to do this and tell and, and tell yourself it is not just for looks, but it's definitely for your health first. A bad eyes body. Ooh, I can't curse. A bad body will come later. I ask you, you guys, to listen, let, not just lay your hands just on them. Lay your hands on me so that I stay focused, that I can stay strong, that I can keep on preaching to them that this is what it is. Do your Christ Jesus' name. Amen. Good day, y'all. <laughs> Sorry. Last but not least, I had to make sure I made my vegetables. A lot of times what we do is we forget to um, have all food groups. You know, you should be having um, the one that you don't have to have a lot of is the carb, complex carb, that is. OK, because you ain't talking. We ain't talking about French fries, uh, white bread, white rice. We're not talking about those things. We're talking about when I say carbs, I'm always talking about complex carb. All right. So those are something that that's not mandatory in your plate. You know, it all depends on your goals, because if you're trying to build bigger booty, bigger thighs, that should be a part of your journey. I mean, don't kill it. Don't overdo it. But um, you definitely can have higher protein, too, because protein is muscle and it helps muscle grow. But back to what I was saying, vegetables is very important. So what I did, I just took some baby spinach, um, 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 sent a handful like that, like right in the middle of my palm, something like that, and put it inside the blender and a half of a half of a banana. Actually, let me show you the banana, how much I took of it. This is the banana. Okay, and look how much I took of it. See, it's not even really that much. Okay, so see how long it is. Girls, get your mind up together. But yes, I only took a you know about that much from the top off, and I blended it. So you want to make sure that you have your vegetable. That is my point. Okay, I didn't have a vegetable inside of my um, my meal. So to have my vegetable, I made it into a drink. All right. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Good day.